The overall goal of these in vivo and in vitro chaperone assays is to characterize the pH-dependent activity of the Escherichia coli chaperone HDEB under acidic pH conditions. Acid-activated chaperones have only one job to do. They need to protect proteins against acid-induced protein unfolding and aggregation. This function is particularly important for enteric bacteria, which have to survive the acidic environment of the stomach if they want to successfully colonize the gut. The methods that we are presenting here allow you to identify and characterize acid-activated chaperones and define the pH conditions that lead to their activation. After watching this video, you should have a good understanding of how to characterize a chaperone such as HDB in vitro and in vivo, which helps you to decipher the mechanism of its activation. These methods have been successfully applied for other acid protective chaperones such as HDA and can be further modified to work with other chaperones and or stress conditions. The influence of purified HDEB on the aggregation of thermally unfolding porcine mitochondrial malate dehydrogenase at different pH values is monitored. Dialyze MDH at 4 degrees Celsius overnight against 4 liters of buffer C. Then, concentrate the protein to approximately 100 micromolar using centrifugal filter units with a molecular weight cutoff of 30 kilodaltons. To remove aggregates, centrifuge the protein for 20 minutes at 20,000 times G at 4 degrees Celsius. Determine MDH concentration by absorbance at 280 nanomolar.